Hey everyone, it's Mindy from the OG Sports Network. Hey, coming to you live with some NHL picks for February 24th. A pretty big card today, 13 games. Uh, so hopefully you will have a great day with the books. Uh, but before we do that, let's go ahead and get over to OGCappers.com where you can see all of the folks that are doing really good work. You make sure you get with one of these hot cappers. You got EPA Sports with Dave still crunching the big numbers. You got Danny Dimes in there just being a sniper and getting one. And then you can see the OG Cappers VIP 2-1-1. So having a pretty nice day. But Dave is up there over the week. And of course, you can see folks over the whole year that have been doing some great work as well. Uh, folks like Gene Got Picks. But you guys, hey, make sure if you go ahead and purchase a pick package or a single game play a la carte, you can go ahead and use the promo code OG20 to save you 20%. Uh, also, all of our games are guaranteed. So if we don't turn a profit, you get your money back in forms of a credit so you can go ahead and have a good outing the next time. All right, you guys, I guess you are here for the picks, right? We have a lot of games in the NHL. Uh, and if you're not familiar with how we work, we're going to go ahead and give you 13 free picks here. It's going to include a side and total. It's also going to give you a confidence factor. So based off of the 800 and some games that we've charted thus far, you're going to get our very best pick out of the puck line, the money line, or the total. And then from there, we're also going to give you a final score prediction. Now, these are all based off of averages, so it's hard for us to come up with the 9-2 to two score, that sort of thing. But we should put you in the right direction on a total. Um, also, you can get, look at the team totals and what they've done and go that route there as well. Okay, so let's get started. Oh, I need to change my background. It looks like, oh, it's kind of yucky. <laughs> there we go. <clears throat> All right. Hopefully you guys are ready. Here we go. All right. We're going to start off with the Blues versus the Red Wings. The pick is going to be the Red Wings at home. We have them at a 3-3 three to three statistical tie, but the Red Wings, they played pretty good during the day. I've won their last seven day, day games here, uh, and they've even covered the puck line in those. So they have won by two goals. Uh, so hopefully it's another good day here for the Red Wings. Oh, went too fast. Uh, then we're going to go ahead and go with the Canadians here in this one, you guys. 58.1%. The road team has covered the puck line in each of the last eight games between these two. So pretty exciting. We also know from Latifa, those devils don't like to play well at home. So we're going to take Canadians plus one and a half goals here. Next up is going to be the Lightning Versus the Islanders. So here it is. It is our text to play of the day. This one here is going to be our second rate, highest rated. And we put this out as a text play because we want to make sure that you guys, you know, get to some picks. If you don't have time to watch the videos, we still want to make sure you have three plays in your pocket there for the day. Again, it's our second best plays of the day. And you can get our best plays at ogcappers.com. Uh, but yeah, all you got to do is text the word at WIN, W-I-N, to 223-203-1821 if you want to get this play. You'll also go ahead and get the NBA and college basketball. All right, we're just going to take the Rangers. I mean, this one's setting a pretty good uh, percentage, 62.7. We have them winning outright, 4-3. to three, And the Rangers have won their last nine. And I don't think it's going to be the Flyers' day to upset the Rangers. All right, Capitals versus Panthers. The pick is going to be the Capitals here, plus one and a half goals. This one comes in at 58.1%. Uh, the puck line, I mean, it's just going to be basically because the Panthers don't do anything. They failed to cover the puck line in each of their last eight games following a road loss. Yikes. All right, and then we're back on the Golden Knights here again today versus the short favorites there, the Senators. Uh, but the Golden Knights, they have won each of their last nine games versus the Senators. And we know the Senators are kind of stinky this year. All right, this one between uh, the Maple Leafs and the Avalanche. Pretty good game. 51.9%, so it's kind of low. But as you can see, this one is closely rated, no matter how you look at it. 
even though I have the Maple Leafs with a two goal victory, but I like it where it's sitting at eight. We're going to go ahead and take over the number six and a half. Uh, <clears throat> in each of the Maple Leafs last four games versus the Avalanche have gone over the total. Plus you guys, we've been charting the, you know, the plus uh, one and a half goals or plus half goal for the first period. And this one here is a over 1.5 first period. It's hit 10 out of its last 11 games versus those divisional opponents. All right, then we're going to go ahead and do another over. You can see this one is also coming in at eight goals where it's sitting at six between the Bruins and the Canucks. This one, though, has a pretty decent percentage, pretty high, 64.3% on the day. Uh, that's because the Canucks last six Saturday games have gone over the total. And this is the same as the last one, like I just talked about. Go over that the 1.5 first period goals that's also been hitting in the last eight in this matchup. All right, Dallas and the Hurricanes, oppo on this one. We're going to go under. This is because the Hurricanes' last eight games have gone under following a win. So we have this one coming in right at six, like you can tell. But again, we work with averages. So sometimes it's hard to come up with, you know, a whole number of two uh, when we're sitting at maybe this one here sitting at 2.7 to 2.5, that sort of thing, right? But we're going to take the under. Again, one of those higher percentage plays. All right. This one here is going to be our VIP selection of the day. Highest rated, you can see it, 66.1. The OG Cappers VIP account has been on fire. So make sure you go ahead and pick that up. Make sure you go ahead and use the promo code OG20 to save you 20%. And again, this one here, VIP play. You must go to OGCappers.com and pick up that three pack where you'll get the best bet also in the NBA and in college basketball. All right, here we go. We're going to go ahead and take the Sharks in this one. I mean, it's one of those that the Sharks on the puck line, they've been playing pretty good. They've covered the last 10 night games. I know it's the Sharks. I know they're stinky. Uh, but look, I have this one with a chance of them winning it outright. So we're going to take the plus one and a half goals, 63.5% of the time. This play hits with the variance and with the odds in this matchup. All right, we're going to go over the total. Again, I got my Kraken hat on tonight. I'm rooting for the Kraken. Uh, but as you can see, it's a three to three game. But we feel like this one here is going to tick to the over, perhaps an overtime game. Then I know that, uh, you know, basically the Kraken are screwed because they can't win in overtime. But each of the last four games against the Central Division have gone over. And this is another one, folks. Go ahead and take the over 1.5 goals in the first period. The Kraken has hit that on their last eight Saturday games. And the last one of the night is going to be the Ducks and the LA Kings. These two combined are 11 and 7 to the over when they play against each other. We have this one coming in at seven goals, so have a one point variance there. Like this play, especially when it's coming in at the 64.3%. All right, you guys. Hey, that's all I got for you today. Make sure you go ahead and like and subscribe. Click on the bell to get the latest notifications because you never want to miss out when we go live with any more sports information. Uh, make sure you check out Dave's top five plays in college basketball today. And then also Danny Dimes has a play in college basketball as well. Plus, we have another video for the three games in the NBA today. Uh, but yeah, make sure you just go ahead. Get with the hot capper every day. Just keep it going. All right, you guys. Take care. Have a good day. We'll see you later. Bye-bye.